Last November 6, Latunario admitted that he himself was surprised when head coach Yang Giao included him in Gila's Pilipinas' talented 20-man pool for the upcoming 2019 FIBA World Cup Asian Qualifiers fifth window. Medyo nagulat ako back at ako napasama. Some eyes likely gleamed when Giao mentioned not only Tenorio's name, but Arwin Santos's as well. The 2013 PBA Most Valuable Players national team inclusion has been a long time coming. Panibagong challenge Sato Kinito, Dahil Matigal Rineko Dinakaka Paglero sa Philippine team. Many actually did not expect Tenorio's and Santos's return to the national team at this point in their careers. The Barangay Ginebra San Miguel guard is 34 years old, while the San Miguel Beerman wing is 37. Add to that the fact that it has been years since the last time they repped flag and country. Tenorio last played for Hill is back in the 2014 Asian Games in Incheon, South Korea. Back then, Hillas came in seventh, an underwhelming finish, considering that they had just come off a stint in the 2014 FIBA World Cup in Spain. On the other hand, Santos last waved the Philippine flag almost a decade ago, as he was part of the Powerade Team Filipinas that played in the 2009 FIBA Asia Championship. That Filipino contingent only placed eighth. Both have actually been included in past national team pools after their stints. Back in 2012, when Chot Reyes took over the program from Rajko Toroman, Santos was named in the heel as two. Zero pool, but he wasn't able to commit. Santos then never had any invitations until Gao came in. Meanwhile, Tenorio had been part of the national team pool under then head coach Tab Baldwin for the 2016 FIBA Olympic qualifying tournament here in Manila. He, along with Calvin Abueva, did not make the final cut. Both Tenorio and Santos, once teammates in the Philippine team that played in the William Jones Cup back in 2016, admitted that after that, they had already accepted their time with the national was already up. 2. Nasip ko na rin yun. Feeling ko di na ko makakabalik, Santos said. To be honest, yes, added Tunorio. I thought that was it for me for the national team. I wanted to focus on playing for my mother team after that. After that, we won championships in Ginebra. So I thought that was it. But fate really has its ways. Dapat magdabakas yun kami. Magfo focus na lang sa kung anong pag kaka abalahin naman magasawa, piro bigla akong tanawagan, said Santos. Sabrang nachitu ako at nagpapasalamat sa panjanun, nabalik niya ako. Well, it's surprising, but at the same time I'm happy that I'm back to the national team, confessed the 5 foot 9 Tenorio. Whatever the decision will be with the final 12, I'm always grateful, Naaman, and blessed to be part of the pool. Dot Santos's and Tunario's inclusion in this current batch of the national team adds more veteran presence. But more importantly, the decorated pro's inclusion only serves as a great example for the adage that age is just a number. Amanan ko pag hindi ko na kaya. Kung hindi ko na kaya sumabe, kung hindi ko na kaya maglaro sa national team. Kung ako na pili tapos di ko na kaya. Kahit ako ayo a. Piro sa nakakita ko naman. Kaya ko sumabe, said Santos. Age also can bring a lot of experience to the team, Tenorio said. We don't call it Matatanda. We call it vets.